right, this will be a video for getting started with practicing some shading. So you have your drawing pencils and you've tested them out. So choose one you wanna work with today. Maybe one somewhere in the middle, like a 2B could be good. So I'm gonna go with this 2B and we're gonna start off our notes by just labeling them. So I'm gonna write shading and value. And then I'm gonna write value is the range of tones from dark to light. in an artwork. Okay, and then I'm gonna create a value scale. So I have a ruler here. If you wanna use a ruler, you can totally do that and really map this out, but I'm gonna drop freehand and just kind of draw a couple of parallel lines. And then I want to get six boxes in here. So I'm gonna find Um, I'm going to say find the midpoint. Hmm, that leaves me with eight. So let's rethink this. <laughs> I think I'm just going to eyeball it and try to make six boxes. So there's one, two, three, try to make them equal size, four, five, Okay, so I didn't need this end. So that's how I'm gonna do it. Just pretty easy, not a lot of planning here. And I'll just label them one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I'm gonna shade these. I'm gonna probably do that. I'm gonna do that in a time lapse so it's a little bit less time consuming for you to watch. But we're gonna shade from light to dark. Okay, and then we're gonna practice some other shading techniques. So we're gonna need a few more boxes, three more boxes to draw in. So I'm gonna make these boxes a little bit larger than the boxes that we're shading in. These will be like little drawings or studies. So the first one I'm gonna draw and just put one single diagonal line from corner to corner in like that. The second one, I'm going to draw a circle in the center, and then I'm gonna draw a circle within that. On the third one, I'm gonna draw a box within a box within another box. And you know, you can fix this up. I don't really like the way that little last little line went, but it doesn't have to be perfect and you can clean up any edges you don't like. This is just for practice, <clears throat> but feel free to make it as neat as you would like. So that's how you set up your notes. Make sure there's plenty of space down here because that's where we're gonna do our mini project. So you wanna take up maybe a little, I'm taking up like a little more than half of the paper. Um, that's fine. I need like another maybe um, little more than a third of the paper to draw the rest. So these are your notes so you can you know make them as detailed as you want but there we go.